this butternut squash lasagna stole the show one Thanksgiving many years ago, and it's become a fall favorite ever since. To make it, peel the skin from one large butternut squash. Slice the flesh into small cubes. If this feels like too much work, know that you need about two quarts of cubed butternut squash to make this lasagna. Transfer the squash to a sheet pan, dress with two tablespoons of olive oil and a teaspoon of salt. Toss to combine, then transfer to a 450 degree oven and roast for about 30 minutes or until slightly caramelized. In the meantime, bring four cups of milk to a very slight simmer. Add a few sprigs of rosemary and a few sprigs of sage. In another pot, melt four tablespoons of butter over low heat and add a minced clove of garlic. Add four tablespoons of flour and stir to combine. Once the herbs have steeped in the milk for about 10 minutes, strain the mixture over the butter flour mixture. Do this very, very slowly. Otherwise you risk the whole pot boiling over. I've done it, it makes a complete mess. Cook this mixture over a low heat, stirring frequently for about another 10 minutes or so. You're looking for the mixture to thicken and you want it to coat the back of a spoon. Once the milk thickens, taste it for seasoning. I often add a teaspoon of salt at this point, but taste it and adjust the salt to your liking. Add the roasted butternut squash and stir to combine. The last item of prep is to beat one cup of heavy cream until it forms soft peaks. Add a half teaspoon of salt and beat again. Once you have soft, billowy peaks, you're done. Because no boil noodles don't always behave as you hope, it's helpful to soften them briefly. Fill a small vessel with about an inch of hot water and dunk three of your no boil noodles into it. While the noodles soften, spread about a cup of the butternut squash bechamel mixture into a buttered nine by 13 inch pan. Top with the noodles. Then soften three more sheets. Spread half of the remaining butternut squash bechamel mixture over top. This is about two cups. Top with a half cup of grated Parmesan cheese. Then top with the softened noodles. Soften the final three sheets of noodles. Then spread the remaining butternut squash bechamel mixture over top. Top with another half cup of grated Parmesan cheese. Then top with the final layer of softened noodles. Spread the salted whipped cream over top. Then top with another one third cup of grated Parmesan cheese. Cover with foil, then transfer to a 375 degree oven for 30 minutes. Remove the foil, then return the pan to the oven for another 10 to 15 minutes or until the lasagna is browned to your liking.
Let the lasagna stand for five to 10 minutes before cutting. Friends, this is so good. Fall comfort food at its best. I hope you love it.